Today's video we start with a hydration chart. Am I hydrated? Aim for clear urine at least 10 times a day. Eat a diet rich in fresh fruits and vegetables. Drink a quart of water before meals. Thank you. Got some jackfruit here. This is frozen from Vietnam because you can't get good jackfruit in Australia unless you're on Clinton's farm <laughs> in North Queensland. There's only two places I know in Australia where I can get good jackfruit from Frank Clint's farm and Digby's up north. Now, Rob Lockhart, he had a good farm, but he sold that one. So, two places in Australia that I know I can get jackfruit from. But you never see it. It's not allowed to be shipped down here. Unless it's sprayed in dimethylate. <laughs> Nuts aren't technically 100% raw. So a lot of people are really like hard on us for going, you guys are teaching steam starches and shit. Well, the nuts you eat at your gourmet raw food restaurant, cooked. <laughs> nuts aren't fully raw, man. I've worked on nut farms, alright? <laughs> I've been on the nut farm, the nut house. Cook! You gotta cook them out, man. Because if you just let them sit around, they get moldy. So you're gonna cook the fuckers in a tunnel dryer. Simple as that. Or, what happens is you let the nut go rancid and oxidize. And it gets all hard and shit. And that nut won't be sprouting. Have a fresh almond or a fresh macadamia. Doesn't taste nothing like what you buy at the store or from the, the fully raw websites. So nuts, pretty much 99.9% .9 of nuts will fly. <laughs> pretty much. <laughs> this fly is going to crack a lot of people. Pretty much. The only nuts that are raw are the ones you picked yourself from the tree last week and you're eating them now. Otherwise, all the nuts are cooked that you're eating. All the tahini, that's none of that's raw, man, ever. I've talked to people who worked at, uh, was it Tree of Life? No. What's that place in Bay Area? Revolution. So, anyway, it's one of the nuts. They're not raw. Because the grinding temperatures that the nuts come in to the factory at cooks the nut butter. So it's, it might be sold as raw because they didn't cook it, but they, it got cooked in the grinding process. When you pour that much nuts, they, <laughs> people think this is someone like stumping little nuts at the, at the shop, just like that. Make it all fully raw and it's not, man. It's cooked. All the tahini out there, cooked. Almond butter, cooked. Macadamias, that taste good, cooked. Cashews, cooked. 100%, man. Heat it up, cooked. Cooked food. You're eating cooked food if you're eating nuts and seeds. So if you want to be 100% raw, fully raw, whatever, that's fine, that's good. Be eating cooked when you eat nuts and seeds today. So you might give us crap for eating steamed starches or promoting such things. But you're eating cooked. So that's hypocritical for us in, you know, does that make sense? It's healthier than rancid fats. When it comes to it's healthier to eat starches than rancid fats, cooked nuts. In, in my experience, I've eaten cooked nuts, or that were labelled raw nuts. I feel like shit afterwards. I've had starches, felt fine afterwards, could actually perform the next day. Whereas you have a gourmet raw food meal, Next day, you can feel it. You can feel the, the the fat in your blood, the sludge. So there's no such thing as a commercial raw nut product, unless it's from your mate down the road backyard. I used to get raw macadamias from the guy down the road, Kevin Clark in Kensington, in South Australia. He used to sell me macadamias, and they tasted like shit because they were raw. <laughs> 
But if they've been sitting in his shed for six months and had gotten all rancid and dry, they tasted all right. But they wouldn't sprout. They're dead. They're dead. So they're not living food anymore. Interesting look. Interesting one. So the only person I'd say who's 100% raw, meaning no cooked food, no cooked food would be Ann Osborne. As an adult, and and potentially mango, mango North Queensland potentially. Ma- I don't I haven't spoken with mango in person for a while. I've been an email, but because mango doesn't eat nuts either. Maybe occasional coconut. <laughs> I might get in trouble for saying that. So I would put money on it. Anne Osborne, as the adult, one person in the world of seven billion. I'd put money on it. Secondly, I'd probably put a little bit of a wager on mango, mango the fruitarian. Has been also 100% raw. But Ann Osborne, I put money in it. Ann might come out and say, Harley, I've been eating vegan pizzas as well. <laughs> but, I doubt it. And if Ann did come out and say, I've been eating vegan pizzas after watching your video, I wouldn't hold it against her. Because to me, it's more about a pers- who a person is than what they eat. Sure, I'd love everyone to eat like is what is best for the planet. But that's not going to happen overnight. So there you go, that's my little rant on raw food. Is they give people eat, eating cooked food crap because they're eating cooked, but they're eating cooked as well. What's the difference, man? What's the difference? What's the difference between eating cooked nuts and cooked starches? So I definitely think the pinnacle is fruit. Fruit. And maybe some flies. But... If you're going to have a debate what's better, cooked starch or cooked nuts, what's it going to be? Cooked starch. Who, who, I learned this from Doug Graham. I don't have a copy of 80 cent 10 around because it always fucking gets stolen. It's, it's a good book. When you give it to someone, they don't give it back. So now people just go get, a, go get your own fucking copy, you stingy pucks. In 80 cent 10, I'm pretty sure it says, or it did when I last read it, it's better to have a low-fat vegan meal, starch meal, than a high-fat gourmet raw food meal. So I was like, <gasps> back in, in, in my year, but early days, I was like, and then I thought about it, I thought about the physiology behind that. I was like, wow, you know, wow. And that's why I felt so shit, eating so many nuts to stay raw. But I was 100% raw, but it wasn't even, because I'm eating fucking nuts. Nuts are fucking cooked. 99.99999% of the nut products out there are cooked. So if you want to eat cooked food, fine, go do it. But don't critique others when you're doing it too. I wipe some jackfruit on here, and little flies, see this little proboscis, see that? Can you see that? I'm not giving you the finger, it's a fly. Look at that, he's licking it up. Licking up some sugars. Get the sugars in. You can't feed yourself on fats. You can't feed yourself on junk. You have to feed yourself on carbs. Simple sugars for the win. Simple sugars are the most essential nutrient for humans. Simple sugars. Cow the fuck up.